、まあ、今回来日されて当時自分たちがやってる野球と今の野球を見てもう何年ぶりだ25年ぐらいぶりだよね、まあ、やっぱ違う the, the... What, what I, I haven't really noticed a difference other than how hard, probably the pitchers are throwing a little bit harder. And、um, the, the players to me seem maybe a little bit bigger. You know, they seem a little bit bigger than when I, when I was here a little bit. And、um, the quality of play to me has always been the same. It's just not, I mean, the play is just as good as it was when I was here. So I, I don't see really any difference than,、uh, than, than that.、Um, And watching the games have been really good. Defense, everything's been pretty much the same. It's just, I think the guys are a little bit bigger, p e o p l e so maybe a little bit harder. Do you have any kids who are in the Yeah, I've done baseball players back home. I don't know. 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 This is why I don't coach in America no more. It's because I cannot deal with、um, kids who have not done anything who think they've done everything. Yeah, that's the same thing. なんかこう言葉が届かない、まあ、まさしくそうなんだやっぱアメリカもそういう問題に接しているんだ見る角度は違うんですけど根本は一緒ですね、うん、なんかトゥーマッチインフォメーションで頭でいく感じでコミュニケーションも難しくなったっていう感じ、うん、だからやらなくなったそうです Well, and also, too, you know, when I was coaching that you know, a lot of emphasis would be placed on certain players where I would be a coach and my voice on the matter would be dismissed because I felt there were other players who were better than the players that they were trying to promote and my voice would not be heard and it would only be because those players were given so much money and to me that's fine but we're trying to get guys to be good to win championships at the big league level. You don't promote guys just because you gave them a lot of money. They have to earn it and then you go okay. Then you can go, but you don't promote people just because you gave them money, they got to earn it. And once everybody's on that field, everybody's equal. <笑>いやいや本当にそれで高校野球を目指すいや、そしたらやっぱそこに野球好きだったら情熱注ぎ込むのも俺は悪くないんじゃないかな If, the, if, the, if an opportunity like that for, for me would, would happen, it, I would greatly、um, look at it and look at it in a, way of,、uh, in a positive way because、um, I'd be able to influence the younger generation, maybe get them to be you know, a superstar in the big leagues here in, in Japan. But for me to coach them would be an honor because I believe that their, their, their perception of me and their attentiveness, you, un, you understand attentiveness, would they be looking at me and being really wide open in their eyes, would be, as a coach, that's what you want as your players. You want them to be attentive. They want, you want them to look at you with their eyes wide open and absorbing information. Right, like we did. Yes, like a couple days ago. Like we did、yeah, a couple days ago. And, <laughs> The reception that we got from those players was tremendous, and I would definitely do that because that's how I would like to be able to reach out to people, kids, to get them there because they want to learn. They don't, they don't feel like they know it all. They, they, there's more information out there to be had, and if I can give them something to make them better, yes, I would definitely do that. I, I have felt that you know, what, what has happened, transpired now in high school, is everybody's. Going up there and being a show about home runs, pimping stuff, looking at you know, all that kind of stuff in high school because they're seeing it in the big leagues. But here in Japan, you can't get do that stuff. You've got to respect this game. And that's what it's about. You don't see any Japanese players in high school standing up there hitting home runs and pimping it and looking at it like that. 
No, that's just so disrespectful to this game. Yeah. And it's and it's all I can't be a part of that. And I don't like it. So when I when I come over here and I see how the Japanese run their stuff and how they build out their base, I embrace that. That's what that's how I like it. That's how I like baseball being taught. やっぱね、今はもう坊主とか坊主じゃないっていうこともあるしあそれはハゲっていうまだあるでしょう。いやあのね今がね本当にね高校野球も変わろうとしてる時なんだグローバルに考えると初めての外国人監督っていう。それをやってほしいしそれで初めて外国人監督が甲子園出したっていうこれはね夢でかいしねメディア取り上げるしねいやだからやりなさいよってそれでそれをプレ俺がプレゼンしてるわけだからやってって。If, they, if, they, if that's a possibility, that would be awesome. And for him to even have say that about me is an honor for him. I, I appreciate that, and, and that, that's really great. And that would be something that I could embrace. And because of the talent of the players, the high school players to me here in Japan are unbelievable. Very disciplined, very mechanically sound. They know the game of baseball. And those are the kind of kids I would like to coach because they're, they're, they're hungry for information, they want to succeed, and they're all about the team. And that's what it should be about. でもこれ実現したら家族なんか OK なの ?You can look, turn around and、yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. We would like to move back to Japan. Japan is our second home, but we would really like to make it our first home. Ah, ほんと帰っておいでよ。だって第二のふるさとみたいなもんでしょ ?It's my second home, but we would like, we would like to make it our first. おお。あのさ、監督になったとするじゃん。ね、ボビーが。電話して教えに来いって言ったら行くよで野村でもピッチ,ピッチャー教えろって言ってたら行くよ多分やっぱり、ね、教え方とかやっぱリスペクトの仕方っていうのは全然違うと思うんだよね日本人がやるのと絶対違うし通訳を置いてワンクッションを置いてもいいけども通訳なしでお前たちが英語を覚えてこいみたいな俺は英語しか喋らないっていう体でやっても面白いと思うんだよ。But to also show that I'm in it with them. I should also challenge myself to speak Japanese to say, hey, look, it can be done. So we can do it together. And that's what makes you together strong, I think. Konnichiwa de. Only de, only. Just to show that we're, we're doing it together. We're in together. And I think that's what a team's about. And not just because you are the manager, you're still part of that team. And if you're showing your willingness to get in that fight with the players, they'll respect you more and they'll give you more. やっぱね、厚さなんだよ、それが一番大事なんだよ、言葉関係ないんだよ、そのハードの伝え方は絶対うまいから、絶対できるから。What would be a better place than do it in Nicosia, in the place where the Bay Stars won the championship and where we won, where Cody and I went for the Bay All Star game? Nicosia has got a lot of history with me and my family, and that would be a great place even to add more history. And then another exciting game we had the other day, we were sitting up in right field. Another great game in Nicosia. You know, we were losing 2 0 and ended up coming back 3 2 0. I mean, it was just a Nicosia experience for us, and, you know, to be able to go back there as a coach in high school. 今ニュ,ニュースで見てるから電話ないなと思う先輩に<笑>甲子園は日本の野球の聖地って言われてるからね There's so much history there I mean I felt it when I went there this past couple days it was just so it just got to me it was just, I mean you look at that stadium and there's so much history there and it's overwhelming to see and getting back up on top and seeing all that dirt field and all that and the smells and all that just that Brought back so much excitement, memory, and you know, all those good things. Even though I don't like playing on dirt, but that's okay. It was still a lot of great memories. <laughs>
っちゃ文句ばっかり言ってたね。He remembered that. Yeah. なんでだよ。芝どこ行ったって。まあ最後になるけど、これからの夢なんですか。I have a, I have a lot of dreams that I'd like to 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 pursue, and the the first one that's in my head would be to come back to Japan somehow, some way as a coach. I'm able to represent not only myself and what I do as far as baseball, but also represent the base stars and everything that they have done for me in my career, and also you know give back to the fans in a way that probably would be a great way to do it would be a coach in high school. I mean that would be a, an outstanding way to do it, and、um, to be able to influence the younger generations here would be something that I would definitely entertain, and it could be something I could pursue for sure. Oh, he's a まあ、でもそうなったら本当にまあボビーが日本の球界で関わった人間電話したらコーチに飛んできてくれるよ、ね、そ,うそうですよね。It would be, it would be an absolute honor. I mean, just by him mentioning that to me, by him saying that he thinks that I should be doing something like that is just so humbling. I can't believe he's even mentioning this to me right now because I never even thought in my wildest dreams of doing something like that. And now he's brought this to my attention. And he thinks it's a great idea to do something like that. I'm, I'm like, wow. He wants me to go teach the younger generations of baseball players in Japan, and I'm honored. I would definitely do that if that if that would be something that would present itself to me. Yeah, for sure. またなんかそういう風になったらプロジェクト立ち上げて YouTube のカメラ持っていくよ。<笑><笑>もうその時は拒否したら首絞めるから。<笑> no, never, 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 never. もうハイスクールのあの YouTube ガチガチガチ。No, no, never. まあまあでもあの本当に夢を応援するし、なんかあったら相談乗るし、ね、まあ日本を援助して、ね、またまた機会があったら出てください。そうです。Okay. Thank you so much. You were a really, really good, very good friend of mine, and I really appreciate him so much. Finally, if you're a fan, I don't know what you're doing, but I'm a fan of you. 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 I feel very honored to be on Poach's、uh, YouTube, and it's been a real pleasure to be here. And、um, it's just to listen to him talk about me like this is very humbling. And、um, I, I just wish you guys keep watching this channel because hopefully I'll be on a, on a high school team. Here soon that he can be following, and you guys will be able to see more of my face on his YouTube channel if you like this face. Perfect. Adasha. Yeah, though.